YouTube. Murray Mayhem here. Gonna be kind of a quick catch up video. Hadn't done a lot of videos this week. Been out of town, just got back home, and man, it's nice to be home. <sighs> I think I'm gonna be home for a couple of weeks now. So that'll be nice. Been out of town for a little bit, and uh, I'm able to come home um, every few days or on the weekends as I, uh, as workload permits. And so the videos have been kind of short. It's just the way it is. But, did want to give you an update on uh, the Murray Gator. I was able to, while I was out of town, I went to uh, um, uh, Fasten All and got the uh, bolts for the axle. And you can see that they are on there. All we have to do now is uh, put the new fuel line on there. We're going to do this weekend. We're going to crank it up and we're going to ride it a little bit. I'm curious to see how well it will do without the tensioner. But we are going to put a tensioner on it. So, that is no problem. Uh, we'll get that all squared away. I am going to show you some of the other stuff that we've gotten uh, uh, taken care of. Uh, the property, uh, all of that. That side is uh, cut and caught up and everything, and this side is as well. My wife did most of this while I was out of town. And uh, we've got a couple more flower gardens uh, that we finished up. And I'm going to show you the garden, uh, the vegetable garden. And some of the tomatoes are around, the plants are around five feet high. and damn near all of them have tomatoes and we got a hundred plants more to come okay guys now we're back and you can see we're gradually uh expanding uh everything to make it a lot easier as far as weed eating and cutting and everything and these are the grapes and you can see gosh they were 18 inches when we planted them and now they're uh probably heck if i stretched it out they'd be five feet high and I planted those on Good Friday. So, do the math. Uh, those things are doing really well. These are a bunch of dwarf uh, gardenias uh, that we planted and moved over here. This is a lot of sun. So, it should do really well over here. A lot of the herbs and stuff that I grow also are going to go in here as well. Uh, catnip. Sweet mint chamomile bloodwort and a bunch of other mints as well so uh, it's all coming together I'll show you the garden more to come okay guys now we're back and you can see how the tomatoes are doing every one of these has tomatoes on them uh, or flowers peppers cucumbers more peppers and onions and garlic at the front squash beans up there everything is growing like crazy uh, it's probably one of the better gardens we've had so far uh, uh, my wife got through uh, weeding this uh, earlier today and gonna fertilize it one more time and then we're just gonna do some maintenance on it so just you'll see this uh, this is that PVC this is all one and a half inch and you can see it stretches on down there and it's uh, I'm actually gonna run it way way on down uh, this is what we're using to do the watering and it's come to uh, work out really well it's an inch and a half PVC and it's like four dollars and fifty cents for a ten foot section and the connectors are ten for five dollars so every week I buy 30 feet and uh, extend it out so I'll have that taken care of as well and uh, all the water that way will be easy and free can't beat that but now going inside and I'm gonna sit down just got home a little bit ago like I said I think, I think it was like a two-hour drive but thanks for watching guys thanks for subscribing thanks for all the shares as well this weekend we're gonna get on uh, Murray Gator and get it finished up mechanically and I'm gonna try to do some riding too. Y'all gonna make some mayhem. This has been a damn cat production.